Hey everyone, I just wanted to share a tip today. I was just getting ready to finish the feet uh, for my desk that I'm making for my son. It's kind of a, a trestle type design. Beautiful curly maple pieces. But from time to time I get an email asking about the, the, you know, if you don't want to necessarily put a chamfer or a round over on, do you just leave it that sharp 90 degrees? And I wouldn't recommend it just because by the time you have that, that sharp, sharp 90, whether it's from your joiner and your, you know, sander or planer, it's just not a good feel on the hands. There's kind of like little splinters, but I think the most important reason is because when you go to top coat this, whether it's a lacquer or a shellac, polyurethane, that sharp 90, it kind of builds almost a surface tension with that finish and fights for that edge. It's almost like trying to paint the, the very fine edge of a knife. You can get the sides real well, but you're not going to get a whole lot of buildup of film on that sharp 90. So uh, I, even if it's you're going for the aesthetic of looking like a 90, and for the scale of something like this, where it's going to be down on the ground and you're looking at it from three, four feet away, you're seeing a 90, but you're actually getting that film to go over there. And the cheapest, you know, there's a million ways to do it. You can have, you know, little hand planes to do it. You can do a tiny little chamfer, but the cheapest, just a little sanding pad and just kind of break those edges just just to make sure that by the time you run your fingers over there it's not necessarily that sharpness and it's you know it's for feel but I think it's more if you're going to be putting a film finish on you definitely want that and even if it's an oil finish it's just not going to feel good so I don't know I guess that's my two cents uh, take it or leave it for what it is uh, my computer kind of crapped the bed so I had like four videos I was going to edit together and I'm guessing going forward these videos aren't going to be very heavily edited. Um, I'm just, I'm not the same person I was five years ago, so I'm, I don't know why I'm trying to make videos like I was five years ago. But I just figured I'd take a little time out of the day to kind of share that with you. If it's not something you guys do, um, definitely give it, a, give it a try. Do some experimenting. You'll see that the, the finish holds up a whole lot better if you can just knock that edge ever so slightly. Awesome. Try and get some time out in the shops today. All right, later.